Let's get started with Ionic 2 app development. Before we install Ionic CLI, we need to have Node.js installed, version 6 or higher. The links to download Node.js, Xcode or Android Studio is present on our blog, link to which is present on your computer screen. So I, I have already installed Ionic CLI. Remember our application is a Cordova application, so we need to install both Ionic as well as Cordova using Ionic install minus G that is global installation of Ionic and Cordova. As I said, I already have Node version 6.7 and Ionic CLI installed. Remember, Ionic CLI and the actual Ionic frameworks are two different things. What we have installed is Ionic CLI. The Ionic CLI will handle downloading the actual Ionic framework onto your machine for each project you create. So in this tutorial, I'll be showing you different ready-made templates which Ionic provides to us. We have the command Ionic space start. If I pass in minus L to it, it will display the templates provided to us by Ionic. There are many of them, but templates like complex list maps, Salesforce didn't work for me. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you three templates that is blank, tutorial and tabs. The command is ionic space start space the project name, space the template name and pass in v2, which means we, are, we want to develop a project with ionic 2. I'll open up two more command prompts. and simultaneously show you other templates too. I'll create a project called My App 2 with tutorial template, of course, with Ionic 2. Next, I'll create my third project that is Ionic space start space my project name My App 3 and directly pass the version V2 or else I can pass the template name tabs and then mention the version v2. Remember our default template in Ionic 2 is tabs. So you could skip mentioning the name and it will install the tabs template by default onto your project. So it will take a while now. Don't get confused here. If you want to take it down, my project that is my app one project has blank template. My app two project has tutorial or side side menu template. My app three project has tabs template. Make sure to get inside the project that is my app one and then use ionic space serve command. Now it will transpile now what is transpiling it just means converting from one language to other language that's because ionic 2 uses es6 but most browsers do not completely support it so we need to convert that es6 to es5 so we ionic transpiles the code we do not need to worry about it i'll just open the same link in my chrome browser now this is my app one project which has which is showing blank template so I'll get inside my app two project and serve it 
the code is transpiled to us and then it opens up in inside a browser so my app to project has tutorial template or side menu template so this is our tutorial or side menu template it has side menus so this labs feature helps us check the project in all three operating systems that is ios android as well as windows how it looks in all those three devices ios device android device as well as windows device now let's get into my app 3 project which has tabs template so it got loaded with the port number 8102 and this is our tabs template you can see that in ios and android the tabs are present at the bottom but for windows the tabs are present at the top this is because ionic follows the default behavior of the platform in windows the tabs are usually displayed at the top we can fix that and i'll produce more videos about that in upcoming sessions for now we need to focus on these three templates blank tutorial or side menu and the tabs template <laughs> 